Hey guys, welcome back again to another unboxing video. I have a couple of new companies to me, which I'm really excited about. And before I get into this though, I want to clarify my, la my last sad little unboxing video that was just so quick and I just started rambling about um, what went on during my last giveaway. I just wanted to let you know that um, the lady who won my giveaway, she got all her bombs and that was fine and they got there safe and sound. What happened was someone just tried to claim her prize and they went on for about a week claiming that they were her and I just kind of had to make sure and sort that out and it's kind of hard sometimes to make sure that people on the internet are who they say they are. So that's all that I meant. I didn't get scammed. Maybe I just kind of said that wrong. Um, but someone did try to claim her prize. And, you know, I just I think that's just pretty awful. Um, I'm not giving away iPhones or iPads or anything like that. I mean, it's a, bo a box of bath bombs, which obviously, you know, we love. And they're really fun. And um, we love them. But um, I just... It was ridiculous to me. So that's why I wanted to mention it to you guys and I wanted to clarify that. So I've had a lot of really nice notes from some of you guys saying, oh no, what happened? I'm so sorry you got scammed. So I didn't really get scammed, but there was someone out there trying to scam bath bombs from my winner. But anyway, that didn't happen. And moving on to these awesome boxes. Okay, so this one, um, I will save that for last. Um, this one is from Bombshells Bath Art, and this is from, um, a, it's a new company, um, the owner, her name is Christy, she contacted me and she wanted me to try out some of her bombs and let me know what I thought and show them to you guys. So we're going to look at these, but I'm going to open this big one first to make sure that I have enough room for everything. And this one is from Sugar Plum Soaps. Now, I found this company, and they're from Ontario, Canada, on Facebook, and they just had some of the most wonderful things I have ever seen. This lady, her name is Deborah. She's super sweet. She's just, she's just a straight-up artist. She's obviously a soaper, but she's, she's an artist, and her, her products, they, they just amaze me. So, um... And I'll tell you a funny story about this, too, once we get into them. Oh, my goodness. What's this? This doesn't look like a bath bomb. <laughs> oh, my goodness. Oh, wow. i tell you what, though. It smells good. Wow. Oh, my goodness. Something in here smells really good. I'm not sure. <laughs> I'm just, I'm sorry. I don't, maybe this, these are just all of her cards or maybe they're gift cards. Like t gift tags, gift tags. This smells so good though, you guys. Oh, these are all her beautiful cards. This is a magnet. Wow. Okay. I'm sorry. Y'all, I'm so type A that if I'm not prepared and you catch me off guard, I just don't know what's going on. But this little box, it smells so good. Okay. This is going to give you a sneak peek at some of the stuff that is in here. You guys, look at that. Those are some of her soaps. Are you kidding me? <sighs> okay. Well... This is just so, so sweet. And this is, um, obviously, this is some information about her company. So I'm going to let you guys look her up on Facebook and on her website. And I'll give you all that information when we're done. What a beautiful little box. Oh my goodness. Okay. All right. Okay, yeah, those are gift tags. 
my goodness. Okay, she just, this is a little card that just says thank you for ordering, and that's just so pretty. Thank you for ordering Sugar Plum Soaps, Whimsical Bath Creations. I hope you enjoy using them as much as I did creating them. Warmest regards, Deborah. So, so sweet. Okay. Whew. This looks like, oh, wow. Okay, well, you know what? Oh, my goodness. I did not. I did not order this much. I did not order this much. Okay, well, I apologize. This is going to be more lengthy than I thought initially. Oh, wow. Oh, maybe this is what smells so good. And this has lavender. This looks like, you know, I just, I apologize if I don't know what this stuff is to tell you. Okay, now, I'm assuming, oh, crap. <laughs> Sorry, I shouldn't have said that. This might just be something that you just stick, you know, is this one of those things you stick in the drawer and it just smells good? And this is a, this is definitely a little bath bomb. You might put it all in the little, little sachet thing and put it in the bath. I don't know. I'm going to have to ask. Oh, my goodness. Oh, my goodness. This is just video. It's just a hot mess just like this. <laughs> oh, God. So sorry, you guys. Okay. Okay. Um, okay, I can't show you these yet. <laughs> I'm sorry. I ordered some things that I don't want my daughter to see because they're Christmas presents. If I can keep her from watching these videos, and she probably doesn't. But in case she does, I'm going to keep it towards the end because she won't last that long even if she goes to watch them. Um, okay. Okay, so have you clicked off or is the suspense killing you yet? Oh, poor Deborah. She's probably like looking forward to a decent unboxing and this is just sad. Okay. What is this? Thank you. Just a little thank you gift for ordering. Okay. I love this wrapping. Oh, these are little cupcake bomb. Look how pretty that is. I don't want to open it. I mean, I do. I'll open it for you guys. And I've seen all this stuff on her Facebook page. Y'all got to go to her Facebook page. It's just amazing. gosh, I'm so sorry. Maybe I shouldn't do unboxing videos anymore. I'm trying so hard. Okay, I'm trying so hard for you guys. I promise. Look how pretty that is. Pretty little bath bomb. Okay. And mm, it smells really good. I can't put my finger on it. It smells really, really good. Okay. And then... God, there's just so much in here. Look at how cute that is. So many smell good scents in here. If there's something, if there's ever a tag that says do not eat, you know it's going to look really pretty. <laughs> really good. Oh my goodness, look at that. Now, she said that this, I, in this little note, she, oh my goodness, she said that this is, smells like chocolate and honey, and this, it does smell like a candy to me. Oh, I know it's not supposed to have any kind of mint in it, but it smells like just one of those really good chocolate, almost a chocolate mint candy. I know that might not be any part of the descriptions, but oh my God, it smells so good. Oh, wow. That does, it smells like food. That's why it comes with a big warning not to eat it. Wow, thank you so much, Deborah. That's just so, so sweet. Aww. She's just sent me so much nice stuff. Look at that. Okay, now I'm running out of room over here. <laughs> okay, let's just keep getting into this. Okay. Oh, 
Wow. Okay. All right. I'm going to move this back. Oh, I don't know how I'm gonna get into this. Okay, this is her bird cage bath bomb. First of all, let's take a minute to appreciate this packaging. Look, this is cardboard. Look, that is a package for a bath bomb. Look at the label, it's gorgeous. It's gorgeous. Okay. This could obviously be a gift. It's a gift to me, to myself, <laughs> but you could order these for somebody and they would just come perfectly wrapped as a gift, obviously. Now, I'm not exactly sure what scent this is, but it smells good. Look at that. Look at how beautiful the little flowers the birds. This is one of those things I was telling you guys. This is just what, to me, the future bath bombs are going to look like. That's just, it's just above and beyond. It's just beautiful. I, I don't know that this is one that I'm going to put in the tub. At least not for a while. It's just, it's beautiful. Okay. Let's move these over here. I just don't want to knock anything off the table. Because, you know, I could do that the way I'm going today. <laughs> I just, I really could. Okay. Oh, goodness gracious. There's so much in here, I just can't believe it. Okay. Oh, my goodness. There's another one with a thank you on it. This is so crazy. I have to keep all the little tags with them somehow. Okay, there are all the little ingredients and the warnings, which are just that you, it's wonderful. Now, something else I haven't ever told you guys, and I've, oh, I've been meaning to tell you in every video, um, I don't have sensitive skin. And yeah, I know you care, right? But um, just in case some of you may have sensitive skin. I know a lot of people do. My daughter has really sensitive skin. Um, so if, if something doesn't bother me and it bothers you, um, you know, that might be why, or I can handle just pretty much anything. Things just don't bother my skin. So, um, if you think something might bother your skin by just kind of watching one of my videos or looking at it, um, yeah, it might not bother me. So just, just FYI. Okay. Oh, look at that. Look at that, how pretty. Now that's soap on top. And I did, I saw this on her Facebook page. That is so pretty. Thank you, Deborah. Thank you so much. Oh, that's exactly what this smells like too. Then this smells like the fall to me. It looks like the summer or the spring. It smells like the fall. This smells really, really good. Okay, okay. This bath bomb, look at it. Comes in a box this big. I can't even hold it with both of my hands, okay? And it's heavy. This, she sold out of, I don't know how quickly, I don't know how many she actually made because it's just so incredible. But when I saw it, I messaged her immediately. Before they even went up on her site and I said, please, please, when you are done with those, send me one. I don't want to miss out on them. I've never seen anything like this. Look at that box. That is gorgeous. Gorgeous. Okay. Oh, I don't even want to unwrap this. Seriously don't. I'm so using this box for something else. Look. Okay. The Lost Bath Bomb of Atlantis. Hmm, what could that be? <laughs> I can't wait to see this in person. I really can't. Okay. It's heavy. Look at it. Oh, wow, there's so much glare on my camera. Look at it. 
it's gorgeous. This is soap, obviously. I don't know if it's obvious. That is just absolutely amazing. So this is the Atlantis Cottage. And she's got a little cottage collection that she's done. Let me see if I can do something about this glare. Hang on a second. Where there are, um, there are a couple different kinds. She's done several kinds of different cottages, different themes, kind of different seasons, different, um, I don't know, kind of just different themed little cottages. You know, that didn't help much. Y'all, look at this bath bomb. Now, I don't, this is really, really heavy. I'm not sure if it says how much it weighs. 13 ounces. It's absolutely beautiful. If you're a Disney fan, Little Mermaid, any kind of mermaid, if you love bath bombs, just if you love soap, just, oh, it's just incredible. It's just, it's just, it's beautiful. It's just beautiful. And it looks every bit as beautiful in person as it did in the picture. And she's got some great, great photos on her site. Oh, wow, okay. So, so beautiful. Oh, wow, Deborah, you just, you are so talented. Okay, now this one is the one that I saw it on her Facebook page and I asked her about it, I sent her a message and I said, hey, do you have any of these? And she said, you know what? I don't, we usually make those in the winter, but I'll make one for you or I'll make a batch for you if you want some. And I just couldn't believe it. I've just met so, so many nice people. And I said, okay, well, I'll take three. <laughs> so, <clears throat> this is what I'm referring to here. I don't know if you guys have ever seen anything like this, but my daughter is obsessed with polar bears. And she would just die over this soap. It's just the cutest thing I've ever seen. So cute. Look at that face. <laughs> oh, well, I mean, I couldn't believe that she offered to go ahead and make some of these for me because I was just going to order them during the holidays, but, um, oh, wow. Well. Oh, it just smells good. It's, I'm just in awe. I'm in awe, and I'm obviously starting to get into soaps. Oh, help me, because there's some amazing soapers out there. Okay, so anyway, I've got three of these, and I won't Oh God, I won't make you go through all, all that. But um, anyway, so that is what I got from Sugar Plum Soaps. And obviously Deborah is just a dear, such a dear for putting all that in my box and making sure that all that got here so safe and soundly from Canada. Okay, next, we're gonna move on to <clears throat> bombshells. I've created a mess down here. Okay, bombshells bath art. Got a little thank you card from her too. <laughs> and um, she got into making bombs. Christy got into making bombs, just kind of crafting with her daughter Sadie. And I just, I think that's really cool. And it just kind of blossomed from there. So, okay. So, um, she sent me some that weren't, weren't very florally and I appreciated that. Okay. This one looks like it's going to be so, so pretty in the bath. And this is the Andromeda. And I'm not, y'all, I don't have scents right in front of me. I just don't. I'm sorry. Because I didn't know which one she was going to send me. And that's why. Um, but this one, it's... Hang on one second. Okay, so that is the Andromeda. And when I demo these, I'll make sure obviously and give you all the scents. Okay, so this next one, had to pull up her page so I know what these actually are. This is the Narwhal Tusk, which is really cool. I love these colors. Not unicorn, close, but not unicorn. Ooh, this one's pretty, okay. Morning Star, her little starfish, and it's not little, it's the size of my hand. It's huge, a nice size. And I've looked at, I've wanted to get a starfish bath bomb, and I've never gotten one. I haven't um, just gotten my hands on one or found the right one yet, so I'm excited to do a starfish. 
That is nice. And then, oh, I was hoping she'd put this one in here. Okay. This is her siren song. Siren like the Odyssey, not like siren like a horn. <laughs> so sorry, you guys. It looks like this little tip is just cracked, but um, it's so pretty. It's just it's so different. It's a different shape, and um, I like those colors. I think this is going to make really pretty bath water. So thank you to Christy from Bombshells. I can't wait to try out your stuff. Thank you so much. It was very sweet for you to send me all that. I will definitely get started on your demos as soon as I can, and um. Obviously, Deborah from Sugar Plum Soaps, and I will have all their links listed down below. Thank you guys for sticking with me. This has just been, I've been all over the place in this unboxing too. Um, I am going to have another unboxing coming up soon because that's just needs to be a whole nother video in and of itself. So I um, appreciate you sticking around with me and just look forward to these demos. I will see you guys later. Thanks. Bye-bye. Okay guys, so I just decided to go ahead and do this at the last minute. I haven't given anything away to y'all in a little while. So um, this is the um, Deep Sticks from Something Wicked and this is scented in amber and sandalwood and patchouli and I got this to give away to you guys because I knew that it had patchouli in it and that one of you guys would really like it because it looks like a really cool bomb. And this one is the Magic Beach from Witch Baby. And these coffin bombs are awesome. And it is citrusy. It's got um, lime and sea spray and agave. And this is just a dragon's egg from lunch. And lunch. <laughs> Lush. And it has seen better days. But, um, you know, I just decided if I haven't used it by now, then I probably won't get around to using it for a while. And it is um, lemon and bergamot. But, um, yeah, if you've stuck around till the end of this video, just thank you so much. And you're just one of the guys that I just appreciate so much. So, um, you can just go ahead and comment on this video, and I'll really appreciate it. And then in the next 24 hours, of course, I will draw a winner. And just a heads up, I think for the next big giveaway that I do, what I will do is do some kind of trivia, um, based on my past videos and they can go all the way back to the beginning so you guys who've watched most of my videos or stuck with me you know since the beginning that will kind of weed out um people who just see oh that's a giveaway and i'm going to enter and i don't know anything about bath bombs and i'm just going to say that i'm a person that i not, am you know that's not who i am so, um, if you're new to my channel, thank you for uh, subscribing, but, um, yeah, I think that's what I'm going to do. So you're going to kind of have to know a little bit about my channel and bath bombs and things like that to, um, win a big giveaway from me. And I think that that's fair to my subscribers who watch all my videos and they, um, have their notification on and, you know, they kind of watch till the end and things like that. So, um, just a heads up, I think that's what I'm going to do. And I'm not going to announce that before I do it. So, like I said, you guys that are watching this kind of get a heads up. And I just, I really appreciate that. So, anyway, go ahead and comment on this video. And then um, I will close that in the next 24 hours. And hopefully in my next video, I'll announce it. If I get one out before then, before I've kind of had time to do all of that, um, that might push out before I get to do this. But anyway, um, in the next video or two, I will announce the winner. And um, this is open internationally. So all you Australia and UK fellows, go ahead and enter because I love you guys too. Um, yeah, that's it. So thanks a lot and good luck to everybody. See you later. Bye-bye.